Hi Aries, welcome back to Omkara Tarot and to another You versus Them. Aries, let's see how you're feeling now, how the person connected to your energy is feeling and what action we can expect in this connection. And Aries, these are general collective readings, may not resonate with all of you. Please keep that in mind. Take what works for you leave the rest so let's begin welcome back all my subscribers and welcome in newcomers Aries spirit all right newcomers I'm setting down two sets of cards here one set will be for you one set will be for your person and in the center I'm going to have your dialogue message cards mutual energies if this is your reading Aries you'll know which side you resonate best with for me, this is going to be person A and this is going to be person B. Bottom of my deck, eight of wands in reverse. So you guys are not really talking to each other even now, Aries, it seems. I do see somebody here wants to fight for this connection, but they're not sure whether the other person wants to reconcile with them. They know they didn't put the work in, I guess. They know there was some injustice that was done. They're scared they will not be forgiven. They know that they were stubborn in the past or may, may know their um, apology will not be accepted. It's almost like they feel they've lost the power in this connection. The other person says, yes, they were very rude. They were, you know, inconsistent with their communication. I've emotionally walked away from them, Omkara Taro. I've cut this connection off when it stopped, basically. I have already turned my back to this connection. I'm trying to see what else is out there. Uh, they were just a cheat. They were a liar. So, and the other person knows that and that's, that's the reason I think they're feeling so scared that they will not be forgiven now. So, let's see. I'm going to, of course, clarify all these cards for you, Aries. But first, let's ask the universe what's truly going on behind the scenes. All right, Spirit. What's happening in Aries' life? What's uh, what with their person and them? Why are they feeling this way? Aries and their person. Okay. The first card here, Aries says protection this connection is divinely guided okay decision a decision is being made about this connection uncertainty someone was unable to make a clear choice that's the that's that was the whole problem i think somebody didn't make a clear choice they didn't make a decision so the universe stepped in to make that decision and protected the person who was i guess uh, getting the short end of the stick is that it spirit let's see if you guys could say something to each other now what that would be and then we'll clarify the rest Aries and their person spirit if they could say something to each other now what would that be Aries and their person spirit all right let's take a few more from another deck Aries and their person spirit Okay, and a few more from a third deck as well, and then we'll start the reading. Aries and their person spirit, if they could say something to each other now, what would that be? Aries and that person all right good to go let's start the reading Aries and uh, if any of you looking for personal readings my email is omkarataro at gmail.com you can reach me there it's there in the description box below as well so the first card here says I'm not worth your tears I want you to find love I was a master at hiding how I felt about you Somebody was hiding their feelings, their emotions. Now they're feeling powerless and they're realizing that the other person never deserved what they, well, dished out. I should have communicated with you more. Expressing myself was hard for me to do. Never communicated, never said anything, played games. It wasn't you. I just needed time to work on myself some more. Well, they weren't ready. I miss you all the time. I love you more than anyone, but I fail to show it. I hope you allow me to step up and turn this around. You're always in my dreams. I regret my past mistakes and I wish I can have another chance with you. Sorry for what I've done to you, 
karma is kicking my ass now. I never loved them. It was just about the passion. I love you. I have to improve myself and my life to feel worthy of you. When you left me, I felt it was because you did not think I was good enough. I'm so afraid that you've left my life forever. It hurts me to the core. All right, so these were some of your messages, Aries. If these were resonating with your storyline, let's start this reading. But uh, of course, as always, an angel blessing card for the viewer. Now, this could be you, Aries, watching. Could be this cross watcher. So, a blessing, guidance, advice, or a message for the viewer. This card says reward. Either either um, the universe is going, going to be sending you big rewards. Uh, one of you is very protected from this connection or from what I feel because the universe was watching uh, maybe the other person's behavior and um, their uncertainty uh, or maybe the person wants to come forward and give you some kind of a gift or something. I don't know. Let's see. Let's uh, go on to the reading and figure this out. Okay, Spirit, let's start with Person A's energy. And uh, newcomers, please remember, these are not gender-based and I don't know which side you're on. If this is your reading, you'll immediately pick up who this person is for you and which side you're on. And yes, it could be a love interest, could be a non-romantic person like a business partner or a relative, co-worker, could be a secret crush, could be an ex or spouse or something. So let's begin. Uh, I'm going to first focus on person A and then later we'll move to the other side which is person B for me. So person A, nine of wands. What's the nine of wands in your feelings and your emotions? Well, secretly, they do want to fight for this connection, I feel. Yeah, they want to rebuild. This person wants to rebuild. They want, they're hoping that this fight can end and a transformation can happen. This person definitely want, is hoping that um, this is like, they haven't said it yet, I think. This is their secret wish. I just wish, wish, wish I can rebuild with the person B. Uh, but what, what? Three of Cups? But they're not sure. They are, they, they are not sure whether the other person wants to reconcile with them. They feel the decision has already been made. They feel the other person has turned their back on them. They, there is a blockage here or they are feeling blocked at this time. Why do you feel this way, person A? Eh? Uh, because they know they never put the work in. Eight of Pentacles in reverse. They were a fool. They were a fool. They never put the work in when they should have. Now the other person is not talking to them. Now as much as they want to return back to the other person, they know that they made some very, very unwise and foolish choices in the past and they know they did the other person wrong. They could be a little depressed at this time as well. Justice in reverse. What's the justice in reverse? Yeah, they never made a choice. That That is the thing. They never made a choice and they know that was wrong. That was not being fair to the other person who they actually did find very attractive who was taking you know who was um, ready or who was uh, showing interest this person never reciprocated okay so how do you feel about the connection now person a how do you see person b and how do you feel about this connection page of cups in reverse what's the page of cups in reverse <laughs> they feel they've been dropped no amount of apology can um, uh, they know because of their ego, their pride, their uh, lack of uh, offering love, uh, they feel that they've been dropped and their person doesn't see them as a soulmate anymore. Emperor in reverse. Emperor in reverse. Emperor in reverse. They know they went about it the wrong way. This person knows they went about it the wrong way. They never offered any anything stable. They were guarded. Maybe this person was playing mind games in the past. Now, as much as they want to come back and try again and maybe hope for a Ten of Pentacles, they know that the other person is never going to trust them again or uh, hates them or is um, will cut them out or cut their head off if they try and return back. Somewhere they are scared that the other person has stopped waiting and has already chosen another path or something they're seeing the other person very guarded very pulled back from them all right so what action person a will finally take i will open data arrays let's go to the other side see how person b is feeling and then we'll do the action cards together 
So person B, in your feelings, in your emotions, we have the Knight of Swords. Yeah, person B says, I'm not going to listen to anyone's BS anymore. They were inconsistent. They would, you know, say rude things to me. They would be in and out of my life. Um, I never knew when they would show up, when they would not. And when they did, they were they were not really polite. I'm not going to wait, spend, waste any more time, you know, uh, feeling that maybe I was not good enough or I was not, there's something wrong with me. No, 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 no. I'm single. I'm independent. I'm beautiful. And I am moving forward. I'm I am not going to emotionally sit in sadness and feel bad about uh, why things never worked out. Well, none of my emotional uh, dreams and wishes came true and that's all I'm concerned with. I'm going to walk away. I'm going to walk away and find something new for myself. Yeah, the, the person um, B says, I would rather move towards new love. Right? Instead of waiting around, I'm not waiting around and being trapped in a connection where... Um, you know, I'm always available for a second chance or something. As in when you decide to come back, I'm, all, I'm always ready. No, I'm cutting this person off. Why do you feel this way, person B? Ace of Swords. What's the Ace of Swords? Yeah, person B says, I am very clear about what I want. I want a person in my life who I can grow with, who's going to work with me, who's going to actually put in the work to make this connection uh, connection grow. Uh, this person wasn't it. They were just uh, pretending to be somebody they were not. They were just being very immature. They were offering me very little. They never put in the investment. And uh, I decided I'm not going to fight for this connection. I, I don't want to deal with a, you know, person who's always going to be you know creating arguments and fights and you know trying to trick me into staying or trick me into having communication with them uh -uh, i'm not interested this is over for me uh knight of pentacles knight of pentacles yeah person b says i'm the one holding back in fact i was loving i was kind i was generous i was giving them my cup i was flowing oh you know pouring into them thinking that this could become something but now i've taken my love back i'm pouring it all into myself okay so how do you see this connection now though person b how do you see person a and how do you feel about this connection three of wands yeah person b says i've turned my back on this yep I, I I did think for a little bit that maybe this could have been somebody I could have grown, you know, with or seen a future with, but they turned out to be a liar and a cheat. And this card has come out twice in, you know, how they see person A. It's like, yeah, the, both these, I mean, it's the same card from two different decks, right? So, and there are only two cards here, which I, which I can ask, how do you see person A? And look at this, liar, cheat. Uh, not telling the truth so person b says it's all right it's all right i don't have to waste my time on people who are going to ghost me or lie to me i know my value and worth i'm not chasing anyone um karataro in fact i have become even stronger you know i saw the red flags i've become stronger and i realize that well i have other options I'm going to check out my other options. I'm going to do right for myself because I realize my value and my worth and I know I bring a lot to the table. So person B could be shining. They could be shining. They could be following their passions, attracting a lot of attention. Somehow this, this whatever happened here has actually made the other person even stronger and more sure about themselves. I mean, they're realizing that it was never my fault. I always was willing to do the right thing but uh, they they ended up being a liar and a cheat i think person a knows that and that's why they are so scared that they won't be forgiven all right so let's see what actions you guys will take then i'm going to take another deck for this one aries and uh, now of course my turn to request you remind you to tap the thumbs up button please if uh, the storyline is resonating uh, it keeps me motivated to do more readings for you and uh, well newcomers repeating viewers do like share subscribe to the channel we welcome you in all right <clears throat> so person a action from your end towards person b or otherwise two of wands are you planning plotting something Oh, I had I have the emperor also bought for my deck. Uh, what are you planning? What are you plotting? What are you thinking? Tell me, what's your plan, person A? 
थ्री ऑफ पेंटिकल्स मेजिशियन ओके स्टार दे आर गोइंग टू बी सेंडिंग अ मैसेज आई डोंट नो विच साइड यूर ऑन एर इज बट पर्सन ए इज गोइंग टू बी सेंडिंग अ मैसेज टू पर्सन बी दे आर स्टिल होपिंग टू मेक थिंग्स वर्क दे आर मैनिफेस्टिंग इट दे आर विशिंग प्रेइंग होपिंग दे आर डूइंग ऑल काइंड ऑफ मैनिफेस्टेशन बिकॉज दे सी दे आर द पर्सन एज देर विश कम ट्रू दे आर रियली मिसिंग दे आर द पर्सन नाउ I mean that this person is sitting in past memories all the good memories I mean they all, all they can think about is the other person they are very attracted to the other person even now and I mean look at this this is like I wish I could go back to the past I'm feeling left behind I'm feeling lost uh, all I want to do is manifest talking to them again I want to work things out so I have a feeling they will muster up the courage maybe to send at least a message or something Okay so what about you person B action from your end towards person A or otherwise nine of cups <laughs> person B says i am here making all my own dreams and wishes come true om kara taro i i mean i wanted the ten of cups with somebody or maybe them but you know right now my life is really really good i am working on myself i'm looking good i'm feeling good and yes uh, i may be alone but uh, i'm not alone because i don't have options in fact i have a lot of options i've, I've just learned from my past mistakes so i'm going to be taking a little time out to think about what i want next who i want next <laughs> all right so tell me about the eight of wands in reverse spirit why is uh, why is there no talking and why is this the overall energy for aries and that person eight of wands in reverse okay eight of, eight of wands is a card of communication but spirit says there is none right now four of swords <coughs> hierophant king of wands chariot okay so the thing here is there is some th i think this is the person who was behaving like an emperor in reverse in the past maybe they were stubborn or they you know were not feeling confident about themselves this is the person who had to take some time out to reflect uh, they are uh, they've turned their life around it seems they are showing up as an emperor upright now they are ready to you know take responsibility they want to come forward and this time round aries they do want to come forward with something really stable they want to offer commitment yes this person is wanting to match the other person's energy as a king of wands to the queen of wands and vice versa uh, they want to travel and come towards their person and this time round they coming in stronger for some reason uh they are scared <laughs> spirit says yes they are scared because they know that uh, maybe they have to start with some kind of an apology or something but they are ready to do it they are ready to do it because all they can think about is please give me a second chance if you can give me a second chance i'll prove it to you that i'm going to be there for the long haul i think this uh, little time of separation or no communication has actually um, made them realize how important the other person is in their life now they're not sure whether the other person is going to accept their apology or not but mind you they are ready to prove it and work for it um uh, they are seeing the other person as yeah really happy making their own dreams and wishes come true and i think that's been the lightning in their life that oh my god have i lost them they look happy without me what if they've moved on from me and that's that's kind of given this person a wake up call they are going through anxiety sleepless nights stress tension and also recognizing that this is the person i want to spend the rest of my life with so it's just a delay i think this delay was meant for uh, it may be one person to realize that they didn't really need anyone they could make their own dreams and wishes come true and the other person to recognize their own bad behavior maybe they needed to heal something from within and recognize the loss before they could come rushing back and try and rectify their mistakes so that is what i have for you aries till next time then love and light take care namaste